Hello viewers, thanks for watching our videos. If not yet subscribe, please subscribe and click the bell icon. So in this module, we are going to discuss that is second question. Find the smallest number by which 3, 6, 4, 5 must be multiplied to get a perfect square. So we don't know what number we have to multiply. So if you write 3645 as squares of any digits, then we will get to know that which number should be multiplied. So let's take 5 square root of 3, 6, 4, 5. So is the perfect square, then you will get in the format of paired numbers. So it is divisible by 2 or not? No, it is divisible by 3 or not. We have to check 3. 3 ones are 3 twos are 3 ones are then 3 twos are 6 then 3 ones are 3 1 and 3 fives are 15 again go with 3 3 fours are 12 then 1 will come then 1 will not divisible by 3 then 0 put then 5 3 fives are 15 again can you move with 3 yes 3 ones are then 1 will get your 10 3 threes are 9 then 3 fives are 15 again go with 3 3, 4 is a 12, then 1 will come 3, 5 is up. Then again go with 3, 3, 1 is up, then 3, 5 is up. Then again go with 3, 3, 5 is up. Then last we are getting as 5 only. So 3, 6, 4, 5, you can write in the format of 3 into 3, into 3, into 3, into 3, into 3 into 5. Finally, 5 is there. You can make this as groups. 1 group, 2, 3, then 5. There is no 5 for this. So, if you multiply 5, so 5 is there. If you multiply with 5, then what you will get here? Let multiply. Let multiply with 5. With 5. Then it will become perfect square. 3, 6, 4, 5 into 5. Then what you will get? 3, 6, 4, 5 into, into 5. What you will get? 18,225. 18,225. Then 5 is the smallest number. Then 18,225. What is that? 18,225 will be 135 into 135. Then what you will get? 18,225. Therefore, the required smallest number. Therefore, required smallest number is equals to 5 to multiply 3645 in order to make it as perfect square number. In this model, we are going to discuss third question that is find the smallest number by which 2400 is to be multiplied to get a perfect square number and also find the square root of the resulting number. So let's take find square root of 2400 then what you'll get is that perfect square or not we have to check 2 post prime number 2 start with 2 2 ones are 2 twos are then I can go with 2 2 six are then 2 2 threes are then again go with 2 2 ones are then 2 fives are 10 then 0 will get again go with 2 only 2 7 are 14 then 2 fives are 75 is getting now it's not divisible by 2 then go with 3 3 twos are 6 then 3 fives are then 25 is not divisible by 3 2 then go with 5 5 fives are so 2 0 2400 you can write in the format of 2 square is there then 2 into 3 then 5 square <coughs> so these are all in pairs so these are all in pairs so what is the remaining one what you should make it this 2 into 3 is the remaining one <coughs> 2 into 3 that is 6 so if you divide if you multiply it with 6 then it will be become perfect square <coughs> here 2, 2 or 2 and 3 are alone without pace. Without pace. So what you can take? So multiply 2400 with 6. Then what you will get? 2400 multiplied with 6. What you will get? 14400. 
100. So let's take square root of, if you multiply with 2 square, 2 square, 14,400 will be, you can take this as 2 square, then 2 into 3 into 5 square. That is 2, 2 into 3, again we are multiplied. So 2, 2 into 2 into 2 into 3 into 5 whole square we are getting. So here actually square root we are calculating. Sorry for that. So 2 square root will go into cancel. Then what we will get here is. So 2 into 2 into 2 into 3 into 5. So that will be equal to 14,400. 120 2 2s are 4 4 2s are 8 then 8 3s are 8 3s are 24 into 5 what you are getting 120 thanks for watching please subscribe yes, thanks for watching our videos if not yet subscribe please subscribe and click the bell icon so in this module we are going to discuss find the smallest number by which 7776 is to be divided to get a perfect square. So actually the number is perfect square or not we have to check. So by taking square root of 7776 you can check and is there any not there pairs then you can divide that one. So let's take through prime factorization method. So you can take 2 3 za then 1 will be remind 2 8 za, then 1 will be 2 8 za, then 2 8 za. Again take with 2, 2 1 za, 2, 2 9 za, then 2 4 za, 2 4 za. Then again take 2, 2 9 za, 18, then 1 2 7 za, then 2 2 za. Then what you will get, again you can go with 2, 2 4 za, 8, then 2 8 za, 16, then 2 6 za, 12. Then again go with 2. 2 2 za, then 2 4 za, 2 3 za. Then again, what you can take it is here is 2 is not possible, then go with 3, 3 8 za, then 3 1 za. So actually, so what is this? You can get again 3, so 3, 3 2 za, 6, then 3 7 za, 21, then 3 9 za, then 3 3 za. What you will get here? So 3 3 is a so 3 3 is a 9. So you can write this as pairs how it is, is 7 7 7 6 as 2 into 2 into 1 pair then 2 pairs then this is 1 pair and like that 2 into 2 into then one more 2 is like there extra then 3 into 3 into 3 into 3 into 3. So let's take this as the pairs 1, 1, 3, 3. So all you can write in the format of 2 square into 2 square into 3 square into 3 square into 2 is remaining here and 3 is remaining here. So finally you can take this as 2 and 3 implies let's take 2 into 3 that is 6. So if you divide with 6 this number then it will become perfect square number. So if you become so divide with let smallest digits that should be divided with to get a perfect square is 6. The smallest number smallest number is 6 then divide with say 7 7 7 6 by 6 then what you will get here is so triple 7 6 by 6 what you will get 1 2 9 6 1 2 9 6 then 1 2 9 6 is perfect square or not we have to check so square, let's take square root of 1 2 9 6 that will be equal to 36 into 36 then 36 whole square then square and square root will going to cancel then it will get 36 yes it's become perfect squares thanks for watching please subscribe